Hello, this is Father, and this is for entertainment and educational purposes only. What a strange week. Okay, let's start with Ape. Okay. <sighs> we had a buying climax here. It's come down. Had one up thrust. Uh, showing a sign of weakness here. There's no volume on this. It's not like they were springing out of it. So... Uh, we can probably presume there's going to be more downside. Uh, they probably bought a little up here. They might bring it up. Um, or they may just drop it tomorrow. Uh, they may bring it up for a, uh, like a cat ear pattern. Uh, it's kind of different than the, the AMC cat ears, but, uh, still the same. Principle, if they do do that, uh, it's definitely not, this is not good here. And uh, the signs of selling are at the top, which uh, we really don't want to see. Anyway, uh, on to AMC. Okay, this is what, this is what the stock looks like when the co composite operator leaves. And, uh. What it looks like, um, like they're selling off, but they're selling off in a weird way. Like they, where you don't see the salt, I call it salt and pepper shaker. This means like where it's breaking apart. This is like mostly retail or weaker institutions. And they took a lot out here uh, to bring it up and they sold a little bit off here, but they brought it up higher, and it looks like they started selling at the end of the day. And this pattern here, until we get up to 10.30, at least from where we are right now, uh, actually broke eight. So, yeah, ten, $10.30, or 50 cents, sorry. On the point figure, we won't even start an accumulation type of thing, so... Um, the fact that it broke the eight dollar level is spooky, but if it goes down to seven, it should cause some type of bounce back, uh, even if it's only to uh, what would it be at that point? Eight fifty. Uh, so uh, this could be accumulation, but. It's being controlled by a really weak institution, and uh, it's not the same composite operator. It's just some, uh, it's being played with by some uh, lower institution at this point. I don't know why the composite operator that wasn't it left, but it's noticeable that they're not doing anything, that it's some lower institution taking control. Okay, the spy. This has been my the thorn in my side. Um, this one uh, has not broke the uh, resistance level yet, but it's it's been in this upward upward um, trajectory all week. Uh, there did look like there was some selling off at the end of the day, but uh, I, it just doesn't look like it's as weak as it is, except when you pull out and you look at it from three months and you say, okay, it's, it's forming a range on this side, sort of like it did on the way up. So I imagine with the velocity that it's one up, just like this one, we're going to come down with a very similar velocity. So uh, I think the earlier puts are still worth holding if you had them. Uh, however, if you did get out at the, uh, when it broke over uh, 92, that was a smart move. Um, 
I'm still in my puts, but you know, that's just me because the whole week has been <clears throat> very hard to assess because there's just been no volume at all except at the end of the day when they do the weird spike of volume. <laughs> so, um, and there's not a very big spike at the end of this day, so very curious. Uh, and it's hard to make out what the spikes of volume are for. Are they sh shorts getting out at the end of the day? Are they shorts dumping at the end of the day? Is it a whole bunch of buying? Is it just a, a settling amount? Uh, I'm, not, I'm not really sure uh, when it comes to spy, but um, volume is higher here. Like when you zoom out than it had been previously, but nowhere near the stopping volume over here where they really bought up and, and brought it up uh, up to here. So, um, or up to here. So I don't see it really going much higher. I don't know how, how it can. It may, uh, it looks like it ended the day <coughs> on the tip of this one. So that may be uh, a kind of sign uh, that it's, kind of reached its climax so uh, be wary of that now if it can overcome this which I don't think it will um, it needs to it has to get over like 410 to really be back in a correction mode and I don't see that at all I see it as very weak so I don't I don't know uh, when it'll fall, but I it feels feels ready to. Um, I know feels it sounds like a great technical thing, but it's it's still in this uh, zone that uh, it hasn't broken uh, up through. Uh, matter of fact, it's like it almost like has like a resistance there where it starts selling uh, right when it gets up there. So. Um, I don't know. Post market has it over it, but you know how that is. It's always like one of those, uh, gotta wait to see how it starts the day. Uh, yeah. I mean, it should be coming, uh, down, uh, much more quickly than it's gone up. And, uh, it's really not showing a lot of uh, strength in its moves. Um, it's been on really low volume, everything. Uh, but yeah, I still feel confident that it's going to fall. It's just a question of like when. Uh, we haven't seen any real big. Uh, sell-offs yet and they may just be waiting till tomorrow to pump up the volume uh, and drop it I guess we'll see tomorrow uh, or it could be wrong it could just actually be continuing up it's 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 a very strange pattern it's kind of like where AMC was doing it's kind of upward uh, movement where it looked like it was going to be distribution every time but then it makes these type of uh, catches and then kind of stays at this uh, in this channel that it's in uh, but I still see it dumping and uh, as far as like a far out dump uh, I see like the uh, that once it breaks through the 88 level the only place really it looks like it's going to catch for a minute is maybe the 371 but will ultimately go past the 360 i believe so that's the way i see it and if you zoom out it kind of looks more uh noticeable 
that we're still on a downward trajectory that each one of these have had the, the small up thrusts during that. Um, this one may be very similar to this where it's had the up thrust and then it has the direct down. And if that's the case, uh, before you would see it catch would be the 371 level. It would just have a straight drop to there before any type of catch and then kind of sideways and then probably a jump down and then this may cause a bigger reaction but ultimately come falling so something to that effect is what I'm seeing um, yeah and I hope that helps uh, helps you kind of see what I'm seeing, like this this volume here, the stopping volume. Uh, compare it to this stopping volume, it doesn't even come close. Uh, so it's really weak. They're not the buyers didn't step in to sell that much off. Um, they caught it here, probably to sell the remaining of this. And uh, they're probably pretty close. And uh, then they're just going to let it come down and play the down game with its, you know, it's got movements up during its down time. So just like uh, when something's going up, it has moments of going down. Uh, but uh, for AMC people, I just I hate to say that it's in a very very poor condition um it's really no longer uh, controlled by the the same person so it's hard to get a a real good read on it but it looks like they mostly got out up here this was like the final point up here and then somebody else has been taking it over going down and uh, it's probably due to the split and uh, probably uh, maybe they switched over to ape because ape doesn't have the salt and pepper thing when you zo zoom in uh, although it doesn't seem to have the same type of well, I guess it has a salt and pepper thing to add as well. So this is when it looks like when an institution really isn't doing much. Um, and, uh, yeah. Uh, it's not in the greatest way, this stopping action here with this sign of weakness did not show interest where buyers really stepped in to stop it, so... Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't imagine this one, uh, holding up and it will likely drop below, uh, four forty three. I think I had a $4 is where I thought would be a good entry point. Yeah. $4 being a good entry point, uh, when it doesn't catch, uh, other than that, uh, I guess that's all I got. I just wanted to do an update. I didn't do one for the last couple of days because I've been watching Spy and it uh, wasn't doing what I thought it was going to do originally. So I've been trying to work out exactly what's been going on and um, they haven't really sold off up here. So I, you know. They have a little bit of stopping action here, but it's not very much. So they may they may raise it up a little bit, but I think it has to get to 404 to be considered a real, a true reversal. So um, if that's the case, you can get really bullish on it. 
Um, or that could just be a a, a uh, markup for a, a lower uh, or a harder fall. But uh, right now, that's what I've got. Uh, yeah, and I'll catch you on the flip side.